Hey everybody, quick update here. They have recently released another beta driver for the Legion Go. It's slightly different than the old build because it has integer scaling enabled natively inside the graphics app. Now, if you want to do this and test out integer scaling, great. It's really simple to do and I'll show you how to do it. If you want to wait for the stable one, which is apparently coming very soon, then just hang tight. I was using Hogwarts Legacy for many, many different testing purposes. RSR didn't do a whole lot. FSR 2.0, it's pretty good. It, it, it's more intensive because it takes some of the resources itself to run. Whereas integer scaling, it, I feel it takes less resources and it accomplishes nearly the same thing. So I have been using integer scaling for Hogwarts Legacy for a while now, at least a month or so. And if you ask me my preference, I would probably recommend that for you to use. It's getting between 10 to 15 FPS boost using integer scaling versus FSR, but that's that's a high point. So I would say at low points you may only get three or four or five. So don't don't hold me to that. But that's what I'm getting on average. I'm not doing data sets to test this, but that's what I'm getting. Integer scaling seems to work fairly well for some things. Other things you may want to try something else. If you already did the registry hack, which I also did, then you may want to test this if you're having issues. I did the registry hack. I've been using integer scaling for quite a while. Had zero issues. It worked quite well in most games and keep in mind that everything is reversible. So let's check out how to do this. You go, you type in REG for registry editor, you open it, you go to H key local machine, then you go to system, control set one, control, class, Scroll down, open up this one here. The differentiator here is going to be the last three digits here, the 968. Other than that, it's very similar to everything else. And then go to 0000. Inside here, you will right click, create a new D word 32 bit value. Okay. Inside that, you're going to type DAL embedded integer scaling support with the letter capitalized for each word. Once you have that, you will go to the value data and type in one to activate it, click OK, and then restart. That is all. If you want to deactivate it but not delete the value, you just go back and type in zero to deactivate it. It's like a light switch turning on and off. You can just right click and delete the value as well. Each time you do this, you're going to need to restart for it to take effect. It's that simple. So this is the original method to do it, and integer scaling did work. Computer's restarted. I will go and open the AMD software. Under the gaming tab, you'll go to the display tab, and now you'll see GPU scaling and integer scaling. There is another method where you can create a file to automatically run this. It failed for me multiple times. There is no point in continuing to do that over and over. So just do this registry direct method. Toggle on GPU scaling, toggle on integer scaling. To test this and make sure it works, you can put it in 1200 mode, and you'll see these black bars around it. That's it, now you know it works. So I will leave it in 1600p, that is the point of integer scaling, and then you will go to your game and render it in 800p, and it will scale it up. I will put the link in the description, it's a lot easier to find it that way. If you wanna access it early, click on the link. There are special instructions here, that's what I'm going to show on this video. I'm gonna open this, you may need WinRare, if you don't have it, W-I-N-R-A-R, -R, download it. So in WinRare, you may be able to get by with Windows new RAR tool. We'll see, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So I'll drag the file out of the archive. Here's the accessible file. So I'll open this and you'll see this .bat file. You're going to run this .bat file as an administrator. Click yes, you'll get this command prompt to pop up. That's really it, it's pretty simple. So you'll see this adding driver package here and it should take a little bit of time. Let's restart the computer, there we go. Computer's restarted. You can right click the Windows logo and you can have a different menu. Then you'll see device manager. That's a quicker way. I often use window key plus X if anyone's wondering to get to that same menu. Under display adapters, you'll see AMD Radeon graphics, double click it. The release date is still showing the 11.7 but this is the new driver. Under gaming, under display, you will now see the GPU scaling and the integer scaling again. The other piece that affects this is the full panel center preserve aspect ratio. Leave that at full panel. Sometimes this will completely deactivate if you change that. Let's see if the test still works here. 
Yep. So you can hit 1200p again and you'll still see integer scaling is on. All right, that's the brief tutorial. Hope that helped you out. Subscribe for more and I will see you all in the next video. Have a great new year. Take care.